Welcome to the Luma Electric instructional video series. In this video, we will demonstrate how to get started with your new Luma Electric resistance soldering power unit and various electrode holders. Step 1. Choose one of three secondary circuits, AB low, BC medium, or AC high. It is recommended first using AB low at switch position 1. Step 2. Fasten the electrode holder to either terminal of the selected circuit. Then attach the ground cord to the other terminal. Note, double electrode holders and soldering pliers do not require a ground cord. Step 3. Use appropriate plunger rod to push carbon electrode approximately one quarter inch from tip of tubing. Attach the ground clamp to the workpiece. It is also possible to clamp or bolt the ground cord to a vise. This will allow the workpiece to be held while also completing the circuit. Step 4. Turn power unit on to begin soldering. To gradually increase heat, turn selector switch and or change the secondary circuit until the desired result is achieved for your application. You may find it is impractical to ground your workpiece. Our double electrode holders allow for resistance soldering without the need to do so. In certain situations, you may find it easier to use one of the models of soldering pliers we have available. We also offer power units that can perform high temp soldering, such as silver soldering and brazing. This concludes this installment of the Luma Electric video series. Be sure to visit www.lumaelectric.com to see our full line of resistance soldering and etching products and other helpful videos.